Good afternoon, everyone. I'm sure you've heard that the brokerage has made the decision to adopt the Broker Bay showing management platform. We're all very excited about this. So I wanted to jump on here today and just give you a quick video tutorial of how to uh, connect yourself to the Sutton Group Heritage Broker Bay platform in advance of our launch date uh, that is scheduled currently for January the 25th. So this is something you're gonna need to do to make sure that you are connected into the Sutton Group Heritage Broker Bay platform. And it's a couple of easy, quick steps that I just wanted to go over with you. Um, two quick housekeeping items about this. I would highly recommend that you do this initial step from a laptop or a desktop system. And in terms of a browser, would strongly recommend that you use Google Chrome. Um, this will not work with Internet Explorer and Google Chrome seems to be the best option for you. So having said that, first thing that you're going to do is go ahead and log in to Stratus. And then when you get into Stratus, you're going to go here and select the Broker Bay button right in the middle. All right. When you select that, you're going to be verified by TREB because you have logged in with your TREB credentials. So Broker Bay will verify you. And then we'll give you prompts to set up your account on Broker Bay. You would select next from here. And that's going to then take you to your profile that you can currently add or upload a photo of yourself. You don't have to do this at this point. You can go back and do it later, that's fine. It will populate with your first name and last name and your email address because it is pulling from your Trump credentials. However, you will need to add your cell number here in order to continue. So go ahead and do that. And then when you scroll to the bottom, you would simply select next. You'll then be prompted to set up your password. Um, the password needs to be a minimum of eight characters, have at least one letter, one number, and one capital. And then you'll re-enter it again in this section, and then click Next. From there, you're going to need to agree to the terms of service. So check the box here, and then go ahead and select Create Your Account. That's going to take you immediately into the brokerage uh, information and your dashboard. At this point, I would just request, please, because we are still in the initial setup phase, that you not uh, book appointments for showings on any of the call your colleagues' listings at this point in time, as they will get notification if they've already gone in and verified but the system isn't actually set up and utilizing. That's our launch date of January the 25th, where that will all go live. Um, there is also a chat feature in here where you can um, communicate with other agents or the front desk. Again, we ask that you not at this point um, start utilizing those. If you'd like to test out some of those features, you can feel free to reach out to any of the management team. Lindsay Barlow has uh, graciously offered to uh, beta test with you if you would like to explore that option, but you can have a look here. Um, and I would highly recommend once you are prompted in there, it is going to give you next steps. It's identifying when our brokerage launch date is of January the 25th. And there's also down in this section here, a link to um, a longer tutorial video on the agent training section. If you just like to get a jump start on things, by all means, go ahead and have a look at that. But just wanted to go over just this very first initial step of making sure that you are linked through Stratus into the brokerage broker bay platform before our launch date of January the 25th. Okay, I hope you found it helpful. If you have any questions whatsoever, please feel free to reach out to us. We're always happy to help and can help walk you through um, 
the initial steps of getting all of that set up. Hope you have a great rest of your day.